This engine, as I said before, was uh, made redundant in 1956. At that time, I was doing my national service, and when I came back, it was gone. Back in 2004, the company decided that they were going to close Somerdale's site, so I wrote the book Somerdale's Story, and from that, been access to all the archive photographs, out came the photographs of the Sentinel. Uh, so I decided that I'd find out what happened to the loco. The loco was reputed to have been scrapped. Wherever I went, they all said that this engine was scrapped because it was used for spares for Sentinel steam wagons. Um, much to my wife's consternation, I still carried on, and five years later, I actually tracked this thing down, and it was in Essex here. The main story is it went from Fry's in 1964. It was sold to Grove Road Scrapyard, run by the Lewis brothers, along with their father, who wanted to cut the engine up. Father said no, so it was reprieved, put on some rails, so he could play with it. It then went from there to Tunley, to a man called Gardeners, uh, and it stayed there for a few years. It then went from there all the way up to Baxton in Suffolk, where it let, stayed outside again, and a bloke called Fimbo, a chappy called Fimbo. And when he died, the guy came up from Essex who used to know the family and took the engine back to his garden. So he then installed it in a Nissan hut, which he built over the thing, grew the trees around it to hide it because the Nissan hut ended up bigger than his little wooden bungalow in his pretty little village in Wicks. The reason I found it in the end, after four or five years of research, because I eventually got photographs of it being moved to Essex by a firm called Cadman's. Uh, and in my usual style, I picked the phone up and, and rung Mr. Cadman himself, not worrying about secretaries and what have you. And he was very grateful. In fact, he's a bit of a conservationist in his own way. Um, he went out and, and located the engine, and it was still there, and got permission for me to go and see it.